Hello, my name is Steun from the Netherlands. Um, I'm, I graduated in 2020 from Public Private. Uh, so my project is called Teunland. It's a world I created, uh, which is actually derived from the, 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 the need, to, the urge to create uh, things. And most, most of the products are made with material I have around. The material that I have around is mostly uh, from the trash. Um, so the, 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 the material that I find in the trash mostly um, decides what the object is going to be. So I, I never sketch. I just take wood or pellet or uh, paper or plastic, whatever I find. And I create, I, I let the material decide what, what the object is going to be. And mostly the objects are based on what I need at that point. So if I need a new closet, I make a new closet. If I have the material for the new closet. When I was young, I, I, I needed external influences, like medicine and, and like a, a, a teacher, which was very strict on me to, to keep on focusing in the class. But at the moment, uh, when, I, when I get material and I start to make stuff, then I don't need uh, external, external stuff to, to keep me uh, focused. So um, the project, I really stay true to myself and really close to myself. It's really something that I really like. Um, I just like to make stuff. Uh, and if I make stuff, I get happy. And I forget everything around me. And I'm, 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 I just get lost and I forget the time. Uh, there's no phone, only music. And I just create. And I, it's hard to stop then. And then when I, when I go to bed, I'm just like in bed, I'm just thinking what to do next. The, the, my biggest struggle was to find, to actually do this project, because like Design Academy, like with the idea of making, uh, I, I, I came to school. That was, I, that, that, that was the, 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 the main part why I came to Design Academy, because I love making. And like the, the first year, there was still still a lot of making, but the second year, there was a lot of conceptual stuff involved, uh, which I had, which was for me very hard. Uh, I learned it. Uh, I, I, my second graduation project is a very conceptual project, um, but I, it was very. I was like with this project, it was very all the time. I was searching for um, something to relate, like uh, like. So, so this 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 thing is solving this, or or uh, this is this is talking about a, a problem about I don't know uh, waste and industry. <coughs> so every every week I came to school and then I, I had this object with a sort of like nonsense conceptual part with it, and then my teacher said, "Then I told you just make stuff and just produce because that's that's what make you feel happy." So that, that was the, the hardest part for me to, to just make stuff because that's something I they, they tried to uh, teach me during the four years of Design Academy to, to make stuff based on a concept. So now it's just, it's, uh, it's, it's still a concept, but it's, yeah, it's, it's different. Well, I'm very uh, lucky that I graduated right before COVID, so I graduated in uh, January. So for me, the, the, the workshops are still open. Um, then uh, I moved to this anti-squat building. I live in an old school building, uh, which I'm very, very lucky as well, because I have a classroom, which is huge, and I have an extra classroom, which is my workshop, but I had to go in quarantine. Um, so I, I had to stay 10 days at home, which for me was fine, because I have my workshop at home. So I picked up some old wood and now I'm making a dining, dining table uh, at home for in my home. So I think that's, that's a possibility that COVID <laughs> sort of gave me. Um, in five years I would like to be uh, running my own studio. Like at the moment um, 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 it's, it's going quite well. Um, some shops are interested, some galleries are interested and I'm having contact with them. But it's not something that I can live on now, so I, I need a side job. So um, the joy I get where, when making stuff 
that joy that that would be like beautiful if I with that joy I can I can make my own living so I can uh, earn all the money that I need just like I don't need a lot of money just the money to 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 pay my rent and to uh, pay my food and I think that would be like that that would be beautiful if I can manage to do that